Weather Authority with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Welcome back, everybody. The entire region remains under a winter weather advisory. Technically, in Indiana, Clay and Green County just went under what we call a travel advisory. It's the lowest advisory. It just means, you know, to kind of slow down, take it easy, really anywhere you're out there. Take it easy. We're not talking about a ton of snow, but it's enough to cause slick roads. And always that first time is a little hard to take as well. Interesting, if you were wondering how rare is a November snow, well, it's kind of interesting. Four of the last six Novembers, we've had snow in November. As a matter of fact, we had, of course, now, last year, 15 and 14. But when you go back through the last 40 years, I can only find 12 times that we had measurable snow in November. So long term, over the last four decades, it only happens 30% of the time. So what this tells us is recently, we're seeing this becoming more common to find snow in November, including just last year when we had snow as well. So it hasn't been that unusual here lately. This is kind of unusual. Temperature drop in the last 24 hours, 31 degrees colder in Terre Haute, 30 degrees colder in Effingham, and 32 degrees colder in the Vincennes area. Yesterday, I hope you got out and got to do some yard work or do something because major changes now with the cold weather. Here's the first 11 days of the month. Six and a half degrees below normal, and we're going to drop that down a lot over the next week as we continue with the very cold November weather. Here's my winter weather folklore for the night. When the leaves fall early, fall and winter will be mild. When the leaves fall late, winter will be severe. Obviously, this year, the leaves are falling very late. As a matter of fact, a lot of those leaves still up there, although the snow is going to knock them down. But leaves falling very late, if you go by that weather folklore, could be a tough winter ahead for the valley. Here's what we had with the temperature today. We hit 45. Again, that was early. Most of the day temperatures have been falling. We've dropped to 25. That's where it is out there right now, 25 degrees. Sunrise, sunset for tomorrow, just over 10 hours of daylight. River stage in Terre Haute's at 6 feet, and it's holding steady. Right now at the airport in Terre Haute, 26 degrees, but northwest winds at 10 drive the wind chill down to 16. As we talked about at the top of the show, wind chills by tomorrow morning right around zero. So really cold weather. These are the current temperatures. 31 over here in Bloomington, 24 pairs, 21 over in Mattoon. So the cold air is pouring in. This is the wind chill down to five Champaign, six over in Mattoon, which by the way, Mattoon just reported three and a half inches of snow. We got to report three and a half inches of Mattoon. Robinson has 11 with a wind chill. Robinson reporting an inch and a half of snow. So it's been a little bit heavier in those northwestern counties. On the water vapor satellite, this is drier air here. That drier air is working its way in. That's shutting off the snow and taking the clouds out of northwestern Illinois. So the snow will end first, then the clouds will clear later tonight. Satellite and the radar over the last six hours, you can already see the snow ending now back here in these western counties as it moves off to the southeast on the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar ending from about Danville, Champaign, all the way down here to central Illinois. So we still have it going on here, but it is moving out of the area. And here's the timing on that. Right now, the northwestern area, is, it is ending probably by 10 o'clock or so. It's mostly over. By 1030, we just show a little bit in the far southeast, and the clouds are already clearing out. And then we're looking at clearing skies. Then the focus is the cold. For tomorrow morning, tomorrow during the day, and really even into tomorrow night. By Wednesday, the winds will change around, and as we start to get somewhat warmer air come in, we'll see a little bit more cloud cover as we head into the middle of the week on Wednesday. The wind right now from the north, it will eventually change over to the south as we head for Wednesday, and when that happens, right there by Wednesday, we'll see temperatures rebounding some later this week. So for tonight, then snow ending probably by 10 or 11 o'clock from the northwest to the southeast. Wind chills to zero. Air temp 11. That would be a new record low by tomorrow morning. During the day tomorrow, sunny but cold. A high of only 23 degrees. And then after that, it gets a little better, but still below normal. 35 on Wednesday, 40 Thursday, Friday, 42 Saturday. Notice we're dry after we get through tonight. The warmest we see is one week from today, and that's still below normal at 49 degrees. That 49 is going to feel pretty good after tonight. You know, I mean, everybody's a big person, you know, out there, but we still need to be aware of how, how dangerous this cold is. Yeah, yeah, very cold for this time of the year especially. And don't yeah. forget about the pets. You know, mm -hmm. this is a big change for them as well. And just take it easy tonight. Not a lot of snow, but enough to cause trouble. Be yeah. prepared wherever you travel. You know, I, I, I've told you I grew up in Minnesota. and we It was a life or death thing. Oh, yeah, up there, Not right. so much here, yeah. but it still could be dangerous. Take some extra yeah. time. All right, what's Nothing up? What's